Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's up V Running Dawn here. Today is my uh, long run Saturday, I'm gonna call it. Um, a long run, why? Because I've been doing these short runs for the past months, really. And today it's gonna be a little bit longer, maybe eight or nine miles, which to some people that's not a lot, but uh, longest run I've done probably all year besides my EHQ 12 hour run that I did in May was longest runs probably about six miles I don't think I've done 10 miles since then but I did do my half marathon so the half marathon is the longest run of this year so far so I'm going to get get myself stretched out a little bit here and get going it's gonna be a slow one uh, I, I don't know how long it's going to take me, but I'm just going to go by feel. But I do, I'm going to run up to the senior center, do my normal five to six mile uh, run in that direction. And then I'm going to head home on the trail. Stacy dropped me off. So that's, that's my plan for today. So let's get going. Doing a little bit of stretching here. Ooh, yeah. If you haven't seen my stretching routine, I'll put a video link here to what my stretching routine been that I do before I go running I change it every once in a while but the one that I made a while back it's something that I I uh, still do most of those so check that out if you're interested oh. uh. a little squatty squatty ah. okay let's get running okay made it up to Northview uh, keeping about a almost 11 minute pace 10 10 to 11 I think was my turnaround pace when I got to the stomp up here it's going to keep it slow try to maintain an easy pace ain't nobody running any races today so not me anyway Goku runners doing 100 miles so we'll see how that goes in his video update put a link to his channel at the end here for those of you who are watching this later on and want to see how he did I'll put a link to the channel and I'll try to remember to go back and put a link to the video of his 100 mile run if I can remember okay guys I have a proposition for you I want to do an experiment uh, I've been making videos on YouTube for a long time now, and uh, I get an average of 30 to 40 views on most of my videos, and uh, whatever that percentage is out of 638 subscribers, okay, the YouTube subscriber rate comes out to about 23%. So, I have a question for you. 30 people, viewing a video that is uh say the last one was like seven minutes long and then after they they view the video no matter how many how long how much time they watch it average time watching is two minutes so looking at the analytics i don't know how long they're watching are they watching the first two minutes? Or are they watching the last two minutes, jumping up ahead in between? I don't know. So I'm gonna try to figure out what's going on there. I have a 15 minute video with my last marathon video, 213 views. Average time is about five minutes. So what's going on is, uh, my video not getting watched or all the way through anyway or how long are people actually watching it uh, now my proposition to you is uh, put uh, in the description below or in a comment make a comment below tell me how long you watched the video if you watched the whole thing let me know down below I'm gonna start doing this thing in my videos that 
I'm gonna say the word, the letter of the day is, and then I want to, I want you to put that letter down in the comments. Now, if you're watching this video and you don't get that part of it that says put a letter of the day down, you won't know what I mean next time when you see the video and, it, and I say the letter of the day is this. So I'm gonna say letter of the day is this. Put it in the comments below. Along with, in addition to or not, how long you watch the video. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do this, make short videos every day so I can find out who's watching, how long they're watching. So I wanna make content that people wanna see. So I'm gonna try to do that to improve the content that I'm giving out. And also to see if the analytics are correct with saying the 15 minute video is only getting five minutes worth of views. Average I could see, and I think some of it might have to do with that little uh, short play that YouTube does, like when your videos are uh, in your whatever you call it, your recommended or your your subscription view, and you hover over the channel, and it'll hover over there and play the first 10 seconds or so however many minutes or seconds it plays. I've done that before. And when I went back in, when I went back to look at the video later on, it jumped ahead those seconds. So is that how YouTube does it? Are those seconds that you're hovering over top of the video getting factored into that watch time? Because, you know, I might see a video, you know, I'm, I'm subscribed to 300 people, whatever. And I don't watch everybody, I don't. I watch what I'm interested in. Some of the things are stuff that my kids subscribe to and they watch that I don't. But if I hover over those, there are those seconds factored into that watch time of that video. Let me know. Uh, letter of the day today, letter R for running dawn. Put the R in the comments below, let me know how long you watched. Okay, that's about 5.94, so when I get to, to the house, or when I get to the end of my road, I'll be slightly under 9 miles, but still be good, it's all good for me. Maybe I'll just loop once here, but yeah, that's what I'll do. I'll loop once here, then I'll head down, down uh, toward Rachel. But about three miles to go, and plus a little bit, and then uh, I'll get this done and over with. I'll close out this video. What do you think? Ready, to, ready to close it out? I mean, it's probably we're probably about six or seven minutes in. Let's see. Okay guys, there you go. One hour, 58 minutes and some change. 9.10 miles. It was a good run. I uh, I walked when I was filming in uh, places that I normally would walk or felt that I needed to walk, I guess. Uh, but anyway, uh, I'm switching more to a time on my, my feet kind of thing. I'm still paying attention to the miles, but it's more important to me to get my feet on the ground, get some hours or time in on my feet. I don't have any big uh, races coming up, long races. I haven't signed up for anything yet. But the uh, EHQ run, I like doing that one. Helps out local communities stuff. So I like doing that run. 
Oh, I have plenty of time to still sign up for that, but uh, it's running around Valley Falls. But I wanna know what you guys think about the YouTube watch minutes, the watch time per video I'm talking about. So if you have a video that's 20 minutes long and, and you see your average watch time is less than 50%, I don't understand that. I understand people watching your video just to get a couple of, uh, uh, no, just a, it blows up the views, yes, but it doesn't do much for the watch hours or watch time because you need 4,000 watch hours in order to uh, monetize. You need a lot of time out there just to get a little bit of money from YouTube. But let me know what you think. Remember, today's word is, or today's letter is R for Running Dawn. Drop it in the comments and let me know how, how long you watched the video. You watched the whole thing or what? I'm curious. But besides that, guys, hope you, uh, hope you liked the video. Like it, comment, subscribe, hit that thumbs up. Uh, share it if you think someone wants to know more about what's going on here in West Virginia and what I'm doing. Most of all, remember it's a great day to go for a run. Wherever you may be, you never get to come back again. So you can see me in the next one. Thanks for watching, guys.